Welcome to our lecture online. Now let's try our hand at the cosine of e, the cosine of a times the cosine of b. So instead of sine a sine b, now we have cos a cos b. And the trick will be the same. What we're going to do is start with writing the cosine of a plus b, and that is equal to the cosine a times the cosine b minus the sine a times the sine of b. And then we write the cosine of the difference of two angles. So here we get the cosine of a minus b, and that will be cosine a cosine b plus sine a sine b. And notice that now we want to maintain the cosine of a times the cosine of b and get rid of everything else. So that means we want to get rid of this and keep this. That means we're going to add these two equations together. So on the left side, we get the cosine of a plus b plus the cosine of a minus b. And that will be equal to 2 times the cosine of a times the cosine of b. And notice that those two terms will cancel when we add them, out, when we add them up. And all, all we have to do is divide both sides by 2. And of course, turn the equation around which means we now have the cosine of a times the cosine of b divided by 2, so we get rid of the 2, equals a half of this. So we get 1 half times the cosine of a plus b plus the cosine of a minus b. So essentially what I did, just to make sure we were following, that I multiplied the right side by 1 half, and I multiplied the left side by one half. Notice that this two cancels out to one half, so we end up with this, and then we end up with one half times what's inside the brackets. And that is how it's done.